Welcome back. And it's time now for Saucy's Take. Peloton shares have plunged over the past several sessions and are on track for a fourth straight day of losses today. That's after the company lowered its full year guidance last week and suggested demand was fading more quickly than expected for its connected fitness equipment. Now, Brian, this has just been a stunning fall for Peloton stock, but it does have some product developments in the pipeline. What's next for this company? Uh, so today, Peloton releasing uh, the long uh, speculated Peloton guide. Uh, and just looking at the photos here, and I have a bigger story on Yahoo Finance uh, homepage right now on this, but essentially it's, it's, a, it's a webcam. Uh, it's four hundred ninety-five dollars. That it looks to have co looks to come with a Roku-like controller here. So, what does this do for four hundred ninety-five dollars? Uh, I think this is Peloton's answer to the mirror, the tonal. They don't want to, uh, at least judging by this product here, see on the screen. That's the Peloton guide. They don't want to put another large piece of hardware into one's house, at least for right now. This product will either go into the top of your TV or in front of your TV and track how you are performing uh, the live exercises or on-demand exercises on the platform. And uh, it is supposed to give real-time feedback if you are doing those exercises correct. Now, I have not tried this product out just yet. It's unclear uh, how it fully works. Uh, but again, that's how Peloton is pitching in. And a real kick in the face here uh, is that Peloton stock is down 2%. I think if this product came last year or the year before, uh, you would see the stock higher. Uh, the, the market has always wanted to see new products from Peloton here. I just don't know if this is the one they wanted to see right now after that quarter this year. Unclear if it's game changing, but at least for right now, the market doesn't like it. Absolutely, Brian. And again, just taking a look here at this stock, of course, did have that record decline on Friday. Wall Street's still clearly focusing on that full year guidance. It doesn't seem like this latest product announcement is necessarily going to be changing that picture here, at least in the near term for Peloton. Uh, but again, that company forecasting sales of up to $4.8 in fiscal 2022.